so this is my issue. Um, I'm using this shirt, and this, uh, that's why you see that spot on it. It's just a scrap shirt, and I'm just trying this design I bought. So I don't digitize or create designs, and this is a, I bought a .pes design from Etsy. And when I stitched it out the first time, um, let me show you. All right, so right here, I did this for my school. Uh, well, I'm working on it for my school, but I don't like the way you can see that the shirt coming through in the background. You know what I'm saying? It's not all solid black. I don't care for that. So, I thought about, and, I, and we're new to embroidering, so that's why I'm asking this question. So what I did was, I stopped it about, when I got about right here, and I said, hmm, but if I go back and do it twice, you know, will it fill it in? Will it break the needle? What will happen? So I went back and I had it filled in. And I love the way it looks up here at the top. But down here, I just went one pass. I'm going to go back and I'm going to try to double it up and see if that will help. But the thing I need answered is, um, is there a way? I'm on the PE800. Um, is there a way to... Uh, change the setting somehow where it'll fill that in or is it just a design flow where it's not filled in or is it that just the thread or if you can answer some of these questions if you send it to somebody send this video to somebody that you know that is a professional you know much more skilled at it, this than we are please give us some help some advice some answers um, yeah and I'm gonna double up and uh, we'll see how that looks but I mean, I shouldn't have to do that. And then I'm worried, will it be too thick um, for my needle when I, because there's more that's gonna be going on top of that. But we'll see, stay tuned. Okay, what I should have shown you was what I did, uh, but I'll go back. And I just went back to find out where I left off with the double stitching. And it was about on the 800 thread. So I was on about two or three thousand so I just went back I did minus 100 um, until I got back to like 780 something and then I went up plus 10 so I can get up to about the 800 count stitch that's what I call it I'm using my language because I'm new I don't really know what you're supposed to call it and now I'm going back and I'm going to try to go over this light part doubled up again okay man that little spot right there is getting on my nerves but it's a scrap shirt, like I said, so try to ignore it. I can't, but you can try. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and, and restart it and see what happens. Yep, hoping it's gonna look a lot better. Okay, I think I'm ready. Yeah. Sorry for the blurriness. I guess it's gonna be moving. The camera shot is just you can probably see the difference in the top part when it's doubling up to the bottom. Now, I mean, I don't have a problem doing that because it's really not too long because it's a small design, but I'm just wondering is that something I'm going to have to do whenever those gaps are in there? Because I just, if it was on, of course, if it was on a dark shirt, you wouldn't really see it. If it's on a white shirt, it's going to be a problem. It came up saying all in green, but I, of course I need to put black thread in it because that's the color I wanted it. I don't care to have a olive green panther. So far so good. Also, we didn't have any problem with needles breaking. I watched some videos and some people said their thread was getting hung school or well, there was a knot in it. I'm going to try to keep an eye on it and find out what the deal is. If y'all know, if you have a PD800, you have a new break, 
help. Let's help each other. Let's figure this out. Look at it now that I, I'm doubling it up. I mean, you can, so you went over it again. I did. And you can tell a huge difference. So, a wonderful YouTube community of people are going to help us out. All right. So, my question was is that something I can fix here? You know, by changing something here, the thread count to close those gaps? Mm -hmm. Or is it a design flaw, I'm going to call it? You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. don't, we don't digitize, so I'm um, just wondering if somebody we can help me out. Yeah. yeah. But I don't, and I said, I don't really have a problem doing this twice because it's a small design that I'm taking on. Yeah. But that can be a problem if you got a big job. Yeah. So yeah. We're going to look at this. Is this a needle I put in yesterday? Or did you redo this needle? No, you did that. All right. Yeah, good job, baby. Thank you. And I also said something about the needle breaking, which I'll do another video on that, but I put it out there. All right. Let's see. Will you take that one off? I'm gonna grab this other shirt. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I might need a little more light. So now the question is, how do you hoop it back where it was? So it hoops in the same spot. To do what? Oh, so you're comparing the two. Yeah, I'm just comparing the two. Got it. I didn't put the rest of the letters on there for this one. Because I was just just practicing to see. And look, would you look at there? Would you look at that? Now that's that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. I can't, I need some more light. Um, okay, here, step on this side, baby. Because when you move, okay. I can see. Turn it somewhere that way. Okay. All right, just step on the side. So, yeah, so that's the one that we just did, and I love it. And this is the one that was before. I don't like it. <clears throat> we're, not, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. That's what we're doing right here. See that darkness? Fade to black. Fade to black. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. So. That spot on that shirt is killing me. I try not to look at it, but I'm drawing my attention. It's, and like I told them, it's a um, it's a scrap shirt. We had started, um, so we just use that. So yeah, um, I'll, I'm pleased with it. And um, but yeah, help me out, uh, digitizers and um, people that know how to work with this PE800. Help us out. Let us know what we need to do we're new with it yeah we're new with it but had we, it less than a year less than a year since like november yeah decent well, the end, no. beginning of december yeah something like november. that but we've been working it yeah we've been working it so yeah. let us know um if that is something that we can fix on here we just got to go over uh, embroidery things twice or if that's just a design flaw that can be fixed in the digitizing process Thank you, Craft Life of the Sandsbury. Subscribe, like, all that. 